Hi, Franklin. Welcome to the Franklin feed. Let's see what's going on, Franklin. Today's weather is sunny with a high of 77. The more you know with Detective Frank Panther. Good morning, Franklin Middle School, 6th, 7th, and 8th grade. This is Mr. Nelson coming to you. I have the responsibility of talking to you a little bit about how you've been doing for the past uh, few weeks. Week 3 overview with our various areas of respectful, responsible, safe, and kind. We're doing a pretty good job. I've seen a lot of kindness. I, I was a, the beneficiary of that kindness this last week, so I really appreciate that. Uh, it meant a lot to me and my family. Um, a couple things, I do work in the cafeteria and we could do a little better job of keeping those tables picked up. Be responsible for your own stuff, take care of your belongings, don't leave things laying around, and we are at midterms. So just as a, you know, the, the part of respectful and responsible is you respect yourself and you're responsible yourself. So take, take that responsibility to another level and turn your work in on time. Low grades, I can't say it's school-wide, but I think the lower grades right now are probably for missing assignments. So get your work turned in. Thank you. Have a good week. The more you know. Hi, Franklin. Thank you for dressing up today. Um, so, as you know, um, some of your first hour teachers, if you have dressed up, give you these tickets. We are starting these tickets, and if you dress up, your teachers will give you a ticket, and you guys will be entered into a drawing to um, actually like win some prizes at the end of the week. Um, tomorrow is career day, and we want all of you out there to come and dress up as what you want to be in the future, or like, yeah, whatever you like. Um, thank you. Is it spirit week yet? Have you been asleep? Yes! So the Veterans Day Assembly is coming up on November 11th and all veterans that are family members are welcome so if that's grandpa, uncles, aunts, anybody, as long as they're a veteran they can come and sit with you. It's at 8.50. Hello, it's Mr. Nielsen again. I just wanted to say um, this is for all of the cross country runners from this year. You guys did a, fab, a fabulous job and I uh, appreciate Mrs. Hale and Coach uh, Campbell for stepping in while I was gone at All City. But um, I do have results. They're posted down uh, by the end of the hall by the office. You can check out uh, your placements. Remember we're giving medals for the top five. So first, second, third, fourth, and fifth per grade. We will give those medals next Friday at our, at our short assembly, and I'll have all the cross-country runners stand up, so we'll recognize you, and then you'll be called down, and you'll get your medal there. So once again, congratulations to all those that earned medals. Our sixth grade girls and our sixth grade boys won at All City. Uh, the rest of the grades did pretty well, but we didn't place first. It was, it was kind of straight across the board. You know, all the schools were kind of equal, so it was a good meet. Thank you. Today for lunch is in fast food there's chicken nuggets or corn dog. In the main in Delhi there's a chicken potato bowl. Don't forget your fruits and vegetables. Tomorrow there's a seventh grade girls basketball meeting in room 100, Mr. Mutso, during lunch. Go meet there. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.